Hey guys, it's Alex, and today I'll be playing a map called Deep in Dungeon. I'm not sure what's going on right now. Um, it says it was it's supposed to be a really cool map, inspired by some other game. Uh, I didn't read too much into it. I just hope that, but I mean, and it looked to be in a three by three by three room because I can jump, and it looks like I'm hitting the ceiling. But all that's here is that button. And, um, so, I'm just gonna go ahead and smack it up, but before I do, make sure that you guys subscribe to the channel for more epic things like this, as well as mod showcases, how-to videos, etc. So, without further ado... Oh, this world is really a horrible place. Destroyed by wars, monstered, infected with the curse of undying. But that night, 15 years ago, the world will never forget it. Lord Oaren and his wizards tried to summon a demon in an ancient temple deep underground. But the thing they summoned, it wasn't just a demon. Demons are mostly neutral. Sometimes even help us. But this beast just killed off he just killed off summoners and ascended to the surface in the castle. Only a few people survived the blood bath. One of them was a little boy, Cain, decided to tearing apart his family and friends. Later, Demon built his own kingdom of monsters and undead under the castle. Then, he even announced the great rewards for those who reached into those dungeons. Lots of adventures tried, most of them died. Somewhere deep in dungeon. So this, I guess this is, this reminds me, and you will die too, I guess. Oh, that's comforting. Th you know what this really reminds me of? The storyline reminds me of Enter the Gungeon. Um, if you guys have seen my videos on Enter the Gungeon, if you haven't, um, they're pretty good. So I'll leave a link towards one or, to one or two of them in the description if this goes well. First thing to downloading the map. The not for casuals, hardest maps I've ever made. Proceed if you're ready for a two challenge. Um, well, I want this to be a, cha a channel made full of challenges, so let's go. Okay, brightness. Brighten. Okay. Uh, video settings. Brightness. 50% Crap FOV FOV 90 I don't really care I'm actually, you know, I'm just gonna keep all my settings about the same Um, render distance 8 or more, dynamic Lights, must be in Fast or fancy Must be Enabled I don't have that No shaders, no texture pack Except the dedicated, wait Oh, uh, there's a special one, and then I have the, um, special update texture pack, and there's the server, it's quote-unquote server. So, I don't know if that's gonna affect it or not. Let's go. Welcome, dear player. I have to warn you, the map is really hard. I was about to with a short tutorial. I'll teach you how to survive. HP is your max, it points, damage is your damage per hit. I don't need to do any, yes, you don't need to explain what gold is. I'm not that bad at this. A sword. And quite a lot of monsters during your adventure. You will have to fight if you want to survive. Practice on a zombie. Also, when you get any damage, you become in, when when you get any damage, you become invulnerable for four seconds. Let's see. I'm guessing that means when I take any damage. I don't want to heal yourself. The only way to heal yourself are those hearts. You sometimes get them after killing an enemy. To pick it up, you have to hold shift. It'll heal one half heart. Okay. You can get you can get gold after picking killing monsters too. You have to pick it up. And then you, if it's evidently less equivalency of gold nuggets. Just like this, you can buy items. Items gives you bonuses like health points, more damage, speed. Careful because you can find a mimic too. This is very much like Enter the Gungeon where there's a mimic. See, this seems. Um, okay, let's shift shitting. Sh uh, shape shifting predator can pretend to be a treasure chest to their adventures. So, are you not allowed to open this? Uh. Special blocks. The left one is a shop. You can spend gold there for items. 
Moan is a boss, the enemy floor, you have to defeat a boss to proceed. The right is an arena, you can fight their monsters to win a random item. So there's special things. Death is permanent here. You have one lot, only one. When you die, you lose all your items, gold, and progress. Or not, you can always try again. Every time you play the dungeon is different. None of your attempts will ever repeat. Teleport and ascend into dungeon. Extras, credits. So first, guys, credits. There, so, um, shout out to all these guys. They built everything, tested everything. And it's, oh, it's inspired by the Binding of the Isaac. Huh. Seems a lot like Enter the Gungeon to me, though. Well, you guys, so I've never actually heard of that game before, but then again, I don't play many other games besides the ones you've seen me in my videos. So, achievements, bosses, characters, endings, huh. So, we're going to see how this will work out, because... Um, I'm not sure about this, but if this video, I'm, if this video gets five likes, let's go with that. Five likes, and I will do more on this, and I will do more parts of this. So, yeah, five likes. Let's, let's smash that goal, guys. Five likes. So I get one character, the war generating, I keep thinking this is Gungeon, <laughs> but it's a dungeon, not a Gungeon. So let's just see what we have. 12, 11. I'm glad we have infinite. So, guys, um, I'm going to give this a chance to say please subscribe if you want to see more like this. I also do mod showcases, how to videos, and then maps and survival challenges. So, catacombs. I'm wearing these health points. Minus 14. Plus 1 attack damage. Okay, damage. And then health point. So I evidently, this the armor is how I get those. Can't go through there. Can only go. This honestly isn't as bad as I thought, but I'm guessing it is. I, I guess I'm just gonna pick all these up. So I can't go... Which direction is there for me to go? Oh, chest. I, I, I have a feeling this will not end well for me. This is different. I'm pretty sure that Enter the Gungeon is very. This is exactly like Enter the Gungeon. You can take. Okay. So I'm gonna try and get as much as I can possibly get before rat. These are gonna be annoying. This is very much like Into the Gungeon, in my personal opinion. Just, you know.
there's the boss. So I'm not gonna. I'm gonna enter the room, but I'm glad. Okay, so if I enter the room and use this strategy, this this shouldn't be this that difficult. Let me see if I can find the um. Definitely, it's a bunch of different things you can get. A sword can break soul sand. Well, I also now have an extra. Zombie AI stays the same. At least I'm glad that it's like really difficult for them to. I have like one half that looks like withered heart. Is that like fake or something? I mean, I wanna. This is actually really scary and it's kinda spooky. Very spooky. I just wish I had like a map or something. But I don't think there's much else here. But I want to try and find something else. There was a chest. There was a shop. Yep, haven't been in here yet. I think the zombies a lot better. They they come after you. Meaning the strategy works. So once I'm close, and I have been, oh, I could have <gasps> heart perfect. I've been, yeah. I don't think there's anywhere else for me to go. So I'm gonna go ahead. And go boss fight. I don't care if I'm ready or not. Um, at least I have a timer, so I know how long I'm going to be. Oh crap! Might crash right here, guys. Oh, that's not good. Slime core. Well, seven minutes. <sighs> that that was very stressful, actually. Um. Well, guys, that is that. This is honestly, I'm not sure if I like that too much or not. But this is a very interesting map. I haven't seen anything like it. But this is a lot like a bunch of other things. So. Guys, if you guys really want, if you guys want me to do more, do, so guys, if you guys really want me to do things like this, you better smash that like goal. And I'm going to set it a little higher, because I'm not, I'm going to set it, just, I'm going to keep it at 5 actually, any higher, and it would be like, making every subscriber I have do it. Speaking of subscribers, subscribe and slap that bell so you're notified of 
any new videos that I put out there on YouTube. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Honestly, it it's it was kind of slow, but it, it I mean it was I really I really like it. I mean I don't like it, but I like it at the same time. It, does that make sense? I don't know if it does or not. But I'd like to thank you guys very much for watching this. Have a great day, and I'll see you guys next.